All right, so here we are creating uh, several hyperlinks, right, that uh, are encoding the, the course and the module, right? And when we click on it, notice that it goes into a blank screen. That's because the, the, the URL that we're generating when we click on this, right, is, uh, is not mapped to any route. All right, so let's fix that. Let's go to our router. We're going to say that hey, this, there's going to be a new, a new route. And that is going to have the the uh, URL pattern that says that it's going to be first the details course ID. It's going to be modules, and then followed by the a module ID that we're going to encode in the path. And so that's the path. Now we need to tell it well what is it that we want to render, and where do we want to go? Actually, we want to actually stay in the same place. We want to stay in the same course viewer. We just want to make sure that the module is encoded in the URL, but stay in the same course viewer. Right. So let's uh, let's take a look at this. Uh, now, if we click on on module, notice that indeed we are we are encoding the ID, but staying in the same course viewer. Click on module ID again. Notice that it's staying. Now it's two three four, and now it's three four five. See that? Um, so yeah. So we have successfully encoded that in the in the URL. Okay.